The rural police of the province of Santa Fe in northeastern Argentina are called the Pumas, as cougars are known in South America. In the past month, their biggest challenge has been to fight the fires that are destroying these wetlands that cover an area of 14,000 square kilometers. Juan Carlos Cristaldi is one of the Puma leaders. He says his team has been working non-stop to catch those who've been lightening the fires. We are told that over 90,000 hectares of land have been devastated by the fires. We are not only detaining people, but also working on preventing and teaching local people the consequences of starting a fire. This is the delta in the Parana River, which connects Argentina, Paraguay and Brazil. It's also known as the Little Amazon because of the rich biodiversity that exists here. Over 11,000 fires have been detected in the past seven months. This area is extremely difficult to patrol. There's over 30 islands here. Environmental groups say that the fires are started by landowners who start the fires to renew the grace, but those fires later on spiral out of control. The government accuses ranchers of setting up the fires, but people from the sector say they're not to blame. This burned pasture has absolutely nothing to do with livestock production or fishermen or anyone. Just someone thought to burn it. All this will be recovered as weather conditions that favor us occur. The lack of rain this year has caused a severe drought, which makes it easier for the fires to spread. Like in the central province of Córdoba, where at least 14,000 hectares have burned. The governor declared the area a disaster zone. The fires are now under control, but environmental groups say it's an example of how serious the situation is. There is a lethal combination ongoing, drought because of climate change and deforestation, but also fires that could be caused by human negligence or with an attempt to take over land. Where there is pastures, there used to be native forests. We need more laws that protect our forests and seas and our wetlands in Argentina. Environmental groups are pushing for a law that will protect Argentina's wetlands and impose tougher fines on those who violate it. It will also mean more resources to protect this beautiful land and the more than 700 species that make it their home. Teresa Bo, Al Jazeera, Santa Fe, Argentina.